More than 1,000 students in Redford are standing together in a battle to end bullying. Three schools came together for a rally, teaching them to be buddies, not bullies. And the kids were so fired up by it all, they wanted to share the message with people on the street. That's right, 7 Action News reporter Terry Edwards has the story from Redford Township. We're buddies, not bullies. Fired up about putting an end to bullying, or better yet, they're stomping it out. It's be me. It's basically all teasing. We're having a bullying march, and uh, we're really excited about it. I think it's great uh, that we're stopping our bully. The rally was made up of students from third to eighth grade, from two charter schools and one public school in Redford Township, teaching kids that they're buddies, not bullies. Buddies, not bullies! Hey. Buddies, not this was a wonderful opportunity for all three schools to collaborate together as a team and come together as a community. And it sends out a positive message to all of the students that we won't tolerate bullying. It is a message we send clearly to all of our students that um, we, we are a no bully zone and that it is not a, an option in our buildings. About 1,500 kids also marched up and down Beach daily to spread their message of love. Not only were the school's principals involved, but so were the superintendents, as well as Redford Township supervisor and commissioner. And we're told this is a lesson the students will take part in the whole school year. Because we understand that bullying takes place every day, so we're just trying to develop relationships with students where they will come to us and report any bullying incidents so we can build those positive relationships and intervene and make sure that bullying doesn't occur. And organizers say the first year this event was put on, there was only one school involved. Now there are three, and it's bigger and better than ever, and they're hoping more schools get involved in the future. In Redford Township, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News. Okay, Tara, thank you.